So, hey guys, I'm Mr. Harry, and this is one of my first eBay reselling videos. So, basically, what I'm going to be doing is 30 sales from eBay and Depop in 10 minutes. So, I think that gives me around 20 seconds per sale. So, hopefully, I can do it. And um, yeah, um, I'm a part time reseller, I buy stuff from Facebook, from jumbo sales from charity shops and yeah I'm looking to expand a little bit more mainly I'm a musician so I don't want to do this like all the time but it's nice to have like a bit of extra cash whilst I'm doing my creative projects which gives me more opportunities to buy beautiful bits of musical equipment and all sorts of stuff um, mainly I'm interested in music equipment I like my electronics and actually like clothing as well so they're my kind of like specialities um, and big shout outs to uh, Nick and Andrea. Um, love your videos and you were like kind of my main inspiration um, originally. So yeah, um, and all the like UK reseller guys. I know uh, Ben Fitzpatrick um, really like your videos as well. So um, yeah, um, so let's crack on with it. So here we go. Right, so this first sale, um, 38 quid. I basically got like a big bundle of different games. Um, a guy was selling like a big box of uh, gaming equipment. Um, the whole bundle was 115, so I managed to sell this for 38 quid. Um, it's a Sega um, Game Gear. Uh, the sale number two, um, Wii Game Party. Um, yeah, this is just a pretty cheap game, £3.39, didn't really get much back for it, but that's from that um, big haul um, that I got the same gaming haul as the last one. Um, and this is a Sega Dreamcast console, um, it was in good working condition, two, actually no, sorry, two of the ports um, weren't working, um, but still it went for £44.99 with a Tomb Raider game. And um, yeah, it's pretty pleased. Same game in Hall, um, so that pretty much got my money back from those sales. Um, and from the same Hall again, 7.99 Quick Shots uh, Spectra Video Joystick uh, for Atari. Um, not a lot on that one, but it all adds up. And now I'm completely in profit with quite a few items left to sell. Uh, from that game and haul. Same game and haul again, £29 uh, for a Nintendo uh, SP with a couple of games. Um, again, it's hard to work out how much I actually paid for this one um, because it all came in this big bundle, but I paid 105 for the whole bundle. Um, and from the first few sales that I showed you, um, I got that money back. Um, so here's a charity shop pickup, it's a Meccano model set, um, I went through all the pieces, uh, it took me quite a bit of time to sort them out and uh, it was complete which was amazing, um, it was actually quite nice and screwing them all for some reason, it was kind of, kind of really satisfying so uh, yeah 100% complete, that was 17, uh, it went for 17 free postage and I paid um, four pounds for that one so not bad, um, it was worth the work of going through it. Okay, so um, ski pants, I've got to give a big shout out to my friend Josh for this because we was in a charity shop together and um, he, shouted, he showed me these ski pants and said, wow, look at these. North Face uh, Summit Series ski pants. Um, I paid five pounds for these and sold them for 60 pounds, which is absolutely incredible, um, which, I'm really happy with that sale um, and yeah really happy that my friend pointed those out uh, so here's another one basically I got a massive haul at a jumbo sale it's a brand new jumbo sale um, I've just moved house and it's kind of been in Manchester and I was shocked at some of the prices for stuff like this like all shoes were a pound most clothing was a pound I got a Polaroid go camera for three pounds so I just literally filled some bag, bin bags and my big camping rucksack and got as much stuff as I can. Um, so yeah, this this sold for £19 and I paid a pound for these. 
um, which got me back quite a lot. Basically the whole jumbo sale I spent £36. So um, so yeah, this has got me back most of that money. Um, and then this one, Horace A. Dean's Ragbook Cold Bear 1997 Collector's Bear. Um, there's a charity shop near me which has like a, a big basket of uh, cheap soft toys and they're all like one pound, no they're all 35p or 50p so I think I paid 50p for this um, and it sold for 17 pounds buy it now um, yeah look out for those little collector's bears um, that's, the, that's the tag there, Dean's rag book um, okay so uh, Samsung Galaxy um, this is a phone which I picked up from Facebook got a few things from uh, this woman on Facebook and um, £23 I got for this, it was broken, um, the screen didn't show anything but it still made the sound, um, but yeah I managed to get £23 for that and I paid a fiver for it so that was a bad little sale. Um, I always pick up broken phones for five, ten pounds because like people they can, they can fix them quite easily. Um, I've done a bit of phone fixing myself as well. Okay five minutes ago um, okay 16.99 I paid for this um, it's a Nike bag and um, actually no 16.99 I sold this for I paid a pound for this off the same woman which sold me the phone um, and 16.99 went for which is which is really good um, I'm happy with that um, Okay, um, trainers picked up from the same woman again. I uh, paid four pounds for these, and these sold for sixteen ninety nine. Um, some Nike trainers, um, Air Max Sequin. Um, a few had sold. They were fairly rare. Give them a clean. And, um, they look good. So yeah, um, Nutella. This is actually a gift I was given for my birthday, which I didn't really need. Um, a Nutella sealed gift box with toast plates. £14.99, which I was happy, because um, I'd much rather have the cash. So here we go, four minutes to go. Um, this one is pretty incredible, actually. Um, me and one of my friends, we went looking in a uh, abandoned care home. I like to, when I find abandoned buildings, go um, go for a little sneaky uh, mooch. And we went into the cellar and I found a, a Pioneer amp, some speakers, the speakers didn't work, um, a graphics equaliser and I found this rare vintage portable cassette recorder as well, so that was all profit and this one, this one sold for £34.99. Um, another thing which I did as well is I made like a, a YouTube test video so people could see that the item was working um, and that always goes down really well in a listing so if you've got um, an old electronic item like this um, make like a little YouTube video to show people like if it works or even if it's faulty show them the faults okay um, right three minutes ago banana grams game um, this one sold for a tenner um, and it was one pound this one so banana gums look, look out for that that was brand new three minutes ago okay um, Samsung Galaxy S6 Edge this was actually broken um, it had a crack I think it was water damage my friend gave me this just to sell and it sold for 75 pounds but um, quite a lot of that was postage it was like 25 pounds post um, that went to um, somewhere in South America I think um, so I got about 50 back for that gave my mate some money for it gave him about 10 pounds for it so uh, yeah that was really good really nice sale um, okay coat hangers IKEA coat hangers um, I seen Nick and Andrea's videos um, one of them saying that someone was gonna come pick up the coat hangers so I thought I'm, I'm trying to get rid of uh, my stuff I quite like my Zen um, I'm meditation and I like having an empty space so I'm going quite minimal with my things so I've decided to keep all my clothes in drawers and get rid of coat hangers so £21.22 for 21 IKEA coat hangers so um, they go for a pound each right two minutes here we go 
Okay, North Face coat, that was from the same Jumble sale pickup. I paid one pound for this and sold it for 39.99, which is um, which is absolutely amazing. Look, always look out for North, North Face, uh, people really like it. Okay, Nintendo AC adapter, uh, brand new uh, DS adapter, that was 9.99 and I paid a pound for that one. Jumble sale. Um, this one, Joe Brown's purple ladies tunic. Um, I paid a pound from the same woman who I got the phone off and sold this one for 20 pounds. Really nice dress. Uh, look out for Joe Brown's um, minutes ago. Okay, 7.99, Mothercare um, plush. 35p I paid for this. Um, Mother Care's, Care's always good. It was in pretty nice condition and I uh, got the feedback on that one, lovely. Um, this uh, I did pick up, my sister wanted me to sell these for her, £22, uh, Adidas Originals, um, really good condition, like barely used, 55 seconds, here we go, um, uh, yeah I got those for free, got this for free as well, uh, given to me by my stepdad, bought a new keyboard recently, so MIDI keyboards, look out for them, uh, £26 that sold for. Okay, uh, Nintendo Wii um, Star Wars con um, controller, seven ninety nine. Uh, that was in the gaming bundle, bundle so um, yeah, that, that got me some more money back. Uh, £21 I sold this for, my friend gave me this, he gave me £25, two phones, uh, one of them here sold for 21 and 3 90 okay, 15 seconds to go. Um, a Wii bundle, paid 30 quid for this. This sold for 16.99, 9.99 postage. Um, that went abroad, really good sale. Um, an extra bit from that bundle, 12 pounds. Oh, I'm not gonna do it. Um, 12 pounds, um, yeah, that, basically that came in the Wii bundle. Um, okay, see if we can do it in the next 30 seconds. Um, right, okay, um, electromag, um, magnetic set, I paid, £2.50 in a charity shop for this, sold for £16. Um, and then Depop, um, paid a pound for these trainers, sold for £17. And last of all, um, Nintendo DS Broken Hinge, um, that was in the gaming bundle as well, and that sold for £13. Woo! Okay, 30 seconds. Wow. Um, okay, um, yeah. So, I hope you like it, guys. I'm trying to just condense quite a lot of sales into one sort of thing, um, one video, so you guys can see quite a lot of sales. Um, I've done pretty well this month. I'm going to do a little sales update on how much I made, and I'm going to show how I actually record all my um, profits and fees and stuff, because I use a spreadsheet and I do it quite, um, quite a specific way, so I know exactly what's coming out. So. Um, yeah, um, I hope you like this and uh, give us a subscribe. This is a brand new channel. Uh, if you're interested in music as well, check out my music. I'll post my little SoundCloud link and my other YouTube channel down. And uh, yeah, thank you to everyone and good luck. Um, I'm going to be posting this on the chat, uh, the, the tap chat group. I love the tap chats on Sundays. So yeah, yeah. Um, this was a really good experience. So I'll see you around. Goodbye.